All right, we're heading back out. Got a nice fresh jig on here. Always nice to get a, a new knot as well. This water is still a little cool though, but these fish don't seem to mind. It might feel cool to me, but I like to grab this that little piece of wood that keeps going around and around. Just because, I don't know, it just seems like uh, it could be a hindrance. I'm going to move this camera down a little bit just because it seems to where the action is. Let's see if we can grab this little wood chunk here and just uh, send it on its way. No, it didn't make it up here. There's one. I thought I was bumping rocks down there, but the fish seemed to like that, and it uh, grabbed it. This is a really I ideal spot if you're going to get a big one, get it down when you're down here. Yeah, right in the top, top of the mouth. There he is. Bring it up close so it looks huge. They seem to like this new jig. The same as the other one. It's just not as tore up. Maybe they came all they all came up back up to the uh, little hideout up here. Let's see if I can walk straight across. There's a lot of rocks down here different sizes All right it's gonna get loud These guys are giving us a good fight. Looks a little beefy. There he is. It's one of the bigger ones. Just try drifting it from up here. Yeah, this isn't our spot, but it's a little corner. They seem to like this jig, this jig just fine, so. Maybe better. Little guy. Alright, we're going to 
going to have to go up here and test this jig. Because I did actually have one other one, the same color, but I think it was smaller. But it probably would still be good. Now it's getting loud. I try not to yell in your ear. like it. They're fine with the new jig. I really wants to get into that uh, hard water. I really miss seeing these smallies jump though. Nice color to this one. It's got a little belly on it. So I, I don't know. I mean, I don't think they're spawners. I mean, they don't have these big bellies on them. I think they're just up here feasting. to the guy in the water over there. This one, this one feels like it could have a little more size. I try to let them fight a bit so they don't pop off on me, get them a little bit tired. These things, these things are not going to tire much. Yeah, so, all right, this thing's, in, this thing's got a stomach on it. It's got a little weight to it. I don't see any food in its mouth. Just a vet. There he is. It's kind of like, uh, kind of like the old days of river fishing, where you can come out and just fish, and they just keep hitting. They're so stacked.
I was just kind of running it in there and something grabbed it along the edge there it came off it didn't feel that big this is they still seem to like it though this is a smaller one a little guy just try and, and uh, tighten up that line when I hook one it's really like all I can do for a hook set Big, big stomach on this guy. Go on out there and eat some more. Got one. Coming up along the edge here. All smallies. Another little guy, got some nice colors to him. This one's pulling. I had my drag pretty tight, so uh, <laughs> I was spooling around, checking to see how tight my drag was, and he, and he jumped and shook it off. Score one for the fish. There we go. They're riding this edge here. I'm getting more with this, with this other jig, with this smaller jig on the edge here. Maybe because it's riding a little differently. But he's good. And they're just hit, they're just hitting this thing. As soon as it hits the water over here, they're just smacking it. But they're not always getting hooked up. <clears throat> as soon as they hit the water, oh man, that little guy jumped. <laughs> he jumped up this this spillway there, like on like a third of the way up. This guy's jumping all over the place. He's not fooling around. Oh, he's really pulling. He's not happy. It didn't look that big. This guy's really pulling. He does not like this situation. It is one of the little bigger ones.
and I get a measurement on that. That's probably like a 13. Looks like maybe a little more than a foot. Good fighter. And they just run right for the for the big water when they get when they get hooked. I mean, I kind of lead them out of there, but then they head right for that big right for the big water. This one feels a little size. He tries to look at he tried turning his head a little bit, get that jig out. You don't want to come up. <laughs> he ain't coming up. <clears throat> He's staying down. He's just digging. He's he's just trying to dig. Dig his way out of it. Oh, nice colors on this one. Look at the colors on that thing. Real nice stripes on that one. This smaller jig seems to work better for for riding that edge over there. It stays up higher. They seem to like uh, they seem to like that. Either that or it's just more of them in there now. Little guy with a fat with a fat stomach. They're just stacked in here. These guys give me a fight. Don't want to come. I mean, I don't want to horse them too much. I just kind of want to fight them out a little bit. And then they, they kind of, you know... They get a little tired being in that... Uh, in that hard water. Man. Big stomach on this guy. Oh man, what are you guys eating? Look at that stomach on this little guy. They're making a killing up here, whatever they're eating. I just saw a fish. I don't know if it was this guy. I just saw a fish skim across the surface and then I got a hit. That looked like a bigger fish that was that skimmed the surface over here. Looked bigger than 12 inches. But I don't know if this is the same one or not. He's staying down. Man, my left, my left arm is getting tired. Uh, he's just a fighter. <clears throat> Little fighter. Our camera turned off. I 
just had a hit. But that's bad. Oh, that fish was still on. What? He just hit it? Must be small. Unless another one hit it, I don't know. He's really, he's really kicking up dust down there. <laughs> Little guy. <clears throat> now that one guy's going back in. Let's see. That's never worked for me. Being down and casting up into this has never worked for me because you're you're pulling your jig away from the fish they're going the other direction when I do it like this I you know if they're here they destroy it but that just seems like that's backwards you're just uh, Oh, I just saw a fish come up over there. Unless you're bottom fishing and you throw a weight and just leave it sit there with a weight with a minnow on it or something. But uh, you see what these bass are doing. They want to chase. They're in attack mode. They're hungry. Let's see if we can pull this guy out of the uh, fish trap. This is like a fish trap. Let's see if we can just lift this guy out. Uh, it's a little bigger one. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have fooled around with this guy. But you get them up out of the water, that's then they can't fight. They can't dig it into that, dig into that current. There he is, big fat stomach. I don't know what these guys are eating. I don't see anything in any of them when I'm catching them. I haven't seen anything in their mouth. So, but they're eating something. Will we get another one? Ah, uh, yeah, there, oh, he lost them. I've never seen so many bass trying to get up the spillway though like that. I see carp, they'll ride that spillway because they're so big and strong. Bass can't stay up there very long. But I've never seen so many of them jumping, trying to jump that spillway. I uh, had another one following me. There he is. I don't know if, he, if I got him on that initial hit or if he grabbed it again. Because I felt it. I felt the smack, but I didn't feel anything after. And then all of a sudden he was on there. So, it was a smaller one. He could have been been uh, going the same direction, so I didn't feel him.
This might have to be like a four or five part series. I am hitting stuff when I'm running a jig through there. I mean, look at those guys. You can see them. Another one just jumped. 